if we vaccinated a woman and trained the immune system to destroy any cell making that protein, the immune system will destroy them. When a woman gets pregnant, a lot of changes occur in her body. And one of the changes that occurs is that there's a protein, it's called alpha lact albumin. That is a lactation protein. It allows lactation. And so that pr protein is produced at that time. Eventually, after she is no longer going to have children or is at the stage where she can physiologically no longer have children, the protein is never produced again. Our bodies are very smart. They know, hey, we don't need this protein anymore, so we don't need to make it. But it was discovered that when cancer cells arise in the breast, those cancer cells are making that protein one more time. And so that's that becomes what, it, what we call an antigen or a target for vaccination. Um, so basically, it, we call that a retired protein. It's needed during lactation, but it's no longer produced any time after that until cancer arises. We believe it's uh, expressed in all types of breast cancer, but we have focused initially on triple negative breast cancer, which is the most lethal type. So the hypothesis here is that if we vaccinate a woman after she's no longer going to have children, it, the vaccine will target that protein. The only time that protein is produced is when a cancer cell arises. And so if we vaccinated a woman uh, properly and train the immune system to destroy any cell making that protein, the only cells through the rest of her life that are going to make that protein are cancer cells. And as soon as they arise, the immune system will destroy them.